Advanced Manufacturing program at Manchester Community College is a very eclectic program. We focus on something that's called mechatronics. Uh, it's a mechanical, electrical system that you program to control a process. Everything we do now is a multifaceted system. So the technicians that we need to do have to have a mechanical skill set, an electrical skill set, and a programming and troubleshooting skill set. And that's the program in a nutshell. And this is the perfect time and place to be in advanced manufacturing because we are blending all of these new elements together. We're blending electrical mechanical. We're blending the 3D parametric modeling world. And students are coming up with uh, new layers, new levels and expectations uh, that I haven't even had for them. All of our programs, we have an advisory committee. That advisory committee or board is a, is a group of those who are actually in the industry who can come and talk with us about what's happening in the field, what their needs are, and then we then communicate that information across our campus. Employers like this because it's getting them people a couple of years sooner, it's getting them with the exact kind of training that they want because here at MCC they work with employers to figure out what, the, what our program should look like to get them the qualified technicians and, and future engineers that they're looking for. Those people that are nervous, they have to start somewhere. Take one class, build upon it with two classes, figure out if you're gonna go full-time or part-time. Everybody's situation is different, and we have to, you know, that's the beauty of the community college, as we evolve that to the needs of our, of our students and our employers. These are very high-paying jobs uh, because the skill set is needed. Not, a lot of people have mechanical skills or electrical skills. They don't have the gamut of skills for that troubleshooting jobs that are out there. Networking is very big in our industry and our world is very small. When companies from California are coming to our campus here at the college to handpick our students, you know, our high school students, our high school population really need to know that, you know, we're being sought after as as role models for what advanced manufacturing or manufacturing and engineering look like. Just say employers call me every day. <laughs> Recently we did a job search and within 45 minutes of Manchester, there are 207 robotics technicians in demand right now and over 1,200 engineering technicians in demand. And that's job openings today. Industry leaders here in the state and in the, the area that come to us looking for employees. You don't have to go very far to get a job. Most of the time too, you, you could probably go get a job at one of these places and they'll pay for some of your tuition costs also. So we have stackable cr credentials. We have, right now we have a certificate in mechatronics and robotics and, we, and that leads into a two year degree in advanced manufacturing. Um, and then we have pathways that go to a four-year school with UNH Manchester, UNH Durham, Southern New Hampshire, Northeastern. So there's a lot of classes that kind of build and stack upon each other um, uh, to build the, basically the skill set you would need for the job you want to pursue. Um, my program is very leveled on purpose, okay? So we, we're not siloed where you have a mechanical engineering degree, an electrical engineering degree, or a programming degree. We want to make sure that when you go into a system, you can troubleshoot the whole system soon enough.